I'm Marcy Dagman, the aspiring gardener, and today we're going to talk about identifying red huckleberry. Now the red huckleberry is native to my area. It's Vaccinium parviflorum. And the way that you can tell is that, first of all, it's a deciduous. Our other native is an evergreen, our blue huckleberry. So first thing you're going to do is look at the leaf, which in this case is very, they're very light, thin leaves. I hate to say it, but from a distance, it almost looks like the invasive scotch broom. So you have to get up closer and take a look. But once you get in, you see the wood. It's got a green layer on it. It's a very brown, woody type of a plant, much like a blueberry. And it's got, of course, the main thing you're going to know when you see these almost neon red orange berries. They're almost salmon colored. And they're kind of tart, but they're edible and they're really good. And I'm not aware of any other huckleberry that looks like this. So if you see this type of berry with this tiny little round leaf, deciduous, so there'll be no leaves in the winter. This is about the normal size, so it's going to be about the height of a blueberry bush. And it's kind of a little scraggly. I mean, you can kind of see where it has twisted twigs. That's something that I noticed right away. It was real twisted looking. So there's quite a few characteristics of red huckleberry that are unlike most other huckleberries. The ones in the mountains that might look a little bit like this have a black or a blue berry. So the main thing is going to be the color of the berry that's going to give you your final clue. And that's how you tell if you found a red huckleberry.